Hey everyone, Technomancer here with a video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to delete apps on your iPhone on the latest iOS version. So let's get started. So let's go ahead and delete an app. So in order to delete any app on your iPhone, first thing is pick the app that you like to delete on your iPhone. So let's go ahead and pick an app. Here I'm going to pick Zelle as an example. The way to do it is long press and hold. So you're going to long press and hold. It's going to bring up this menu that says remove app. So when you click on remove app, it's going to bring up another menu that says remove app where you can go ahead now delete it by clicking on delete app. So once you do that, it'll give you one more final confirmation to deleting this app and it'll ask you that and you click on delete and it's been removed and it's completely removed from your iPhone and you'll not be able to see it anywhere even in the app library if you look for it. The one that I deleted, it's not there. So that's going to be one way to do it. Another way to do it is by looking at the list of apps you have on your iPhone. So in order to do that, you're going to go into your setting on your iPhone and then go to general and then go to iPhone storage. And then all of the apps are going to be listed here. So if you can see here, I have all the list of apps available here. So if I wanted to delete one, I can also do it by following this method, clicking on the app. There's an option that says delete app. Tap on that. It's going to ask you to confirm that you want to delete the app. So we go ahead and delete it just like that. Now do keep in mind that if you have an app that you're deleting and you created an account, you need to delete the account also. Deleting an app does not delete the account on that app that you're using. So you have to first delete that account if you want to completely uh, delete your account and then remove the app. But that's how you go ahead and delete app on your iPhone. I hope this video was helpful. If so, please consider a like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks for your iPhone. We'll see you guys next time.